Bro, since I last saw you, I was cruising in the crew. I was with my crew. This is my fifth time trying to record this intro. I haven't recorded in, what, eight months, so this feels kind of weird, but I'm just gonna have to get used to it. It's been almost a year since the last time I uploaded, and there's lots of reasons for that, but I don't wanna get into that right now. But anyway, that's not what this video is about. All right, I was trying to explain the project and like the backstory to it, but I kept stuttering and yeah, it just didn't really come out well, and I'm not going to record everything again. So, pretty much what I was saying was, nine months ago, I was working on a little air conditioner thing, which was really just a fan, and I'm going to be continuing that today, and I'm going to add a temperature sensor to it. Alright, so the first time I tried to do this, the motor just broke, the wires came off. I broke it. I broke it. It fell off. <laughs> So, we're gonna have to try to fix that, because I'm not gonna try to use tape again. So yeah, let's check if it even works. The wires were supposed to be there and there, <laughs> yeah, they just came off. So, we're gonna have to try to do this again. Yo, it works, alright. Um, so, we know it works now. We just need to solder it. I don't know exactly what this is, but I think it's a solder gun. So we're just gonna have to try it. So, we're under my desk right now. Oh, I can't tell if it's working. <laughs> Yo, it worked. All right, there we go. That's one of them done. Oh, I just realized you can't even see the battery. Or the motor. But uh, yeah, there's smoke coming out of this. So, that's cool. I'm actually surprised that worked. I didn't even know if it was a solder gun or not. But, alright, let's try this out. This should be easier now. So, alright, yeah, it works. <laughs> alright, so it's the next day. We're actually gonna get started now. I don't know how this little thing is supposed to get the temperature, but it's pretty small. Alright, so apparently I need a library for this, and I don't know if I have it. And as you can probably see, I'm on Linux now, and if you know Linux, it's really hard to download stuff, so that might be a problem. Alright, so I fixed it. <laughs> I just realized I had the wrong thing the whole time. So this is what it actually was. And I misread the name and I thought it was this. And let's see, temperature didn't change much. Yeah, temperature went up a little <laughs> bit, but man. And let's see, temperature didn't change much. It's funny because I was doing the exact same thing before I even saw this. Alright, so it's pretty accurate. It's going up after I blew on it. So, yeah, <laughs> we need to make the fan now. I don't know how I'm going to do this. It doesn't have a stand or anything. So... When I plug it in, it's just gonna look like that. There's only two wires, and it's just a negative and a positive. So, it just works right when you plug it in. Alright, so I have an idea. If this works, I'm honestly gonna be surprised. Alright, I'm gonna upload it right now, and 
the fan should immediately start moving. <laughs> I did that without a tutorial and I haven't done electronics in almost a year. Look at that. <laughs> the thing with this fan is the air right now is blowing this way. So like you can't feel any air on top. It's just going straight down. So what if I put it on top of the temperature sensor? <clears throat> now we need to turn it on when the temperature is high enough. So here's what's happening. When the temperature gets high enough, the fan turns on and that's pretty much it. But we need to make it we need to make it a little harder first. Alright, so I fixed all the bugs and it should start working now. Alright, so right when the temperature reaches 32, it turns on and it goes off when it's less than that. Like I said in the intro, there's going to be a lot more videos and I'm going to be documenting the whole process of every project that I make. So drop a sub, like, comment, all of that. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next video.